yeah, he's, he's terminates from Edmonton as well. He actually went to man's school, but um, he was too old for man uh, for me to be in the, the school at the same time, innit? So, like, when I started Winchmore, he had already left because there's, like, six years between us. So, yeah, it's a bit like me and my little brother. My little brother went to my school. He went to Winchmore as well. But by the time he came to Winchmore, I'd already left. Now, if I stayed on in sixth form, then we would have been in the school at the same time. But he's just too young. He's, like, he's six and a half years younger than me, but I think he's seven years below, man, isn't it? So my little brother's just too young for us to be in school. But... Funny enough, man still had a reputation in school, even after man done left, you know. So, like, in my school, in my year group, like, man was, like, one of, like, the popular youths and, and like, man used to have a love-hate relationship with the people in the year above me, you know. They used to beat me up all the time, you know. Like, not take my money or nothing like that. Although, man had to stand up to some youths in my year group when I was, like, in year eight because they used to try and rob man, basically, for my Christmas, my dream. But the year above, man... In my school and other schools as well, if you went to a black school, you probably experienced this. The, the year above you will come and try and beat you up. For no reason, you know. Now, if you're some little neaky nerd, oh, Anonymous is going to get on to me because I called someone neaky. The, the, the neat police is here, isn't it? Anyway, boom. Um, the year above man used to come and beat man up. And uh, Again, if you're a little neaky nerd, if you was a no one, you didn't get touched because you were just irrelevant. But if you was a someone in that year group, you're gonna you're gonna hold some. So then man used to always get on to man and that for like no reason, you know. To be fair though, man used to run my mouth to them and run off now and then and that. So that's probably why I didn't like even there was times where I was excluded from school, you know. Man's at yard, you know. They'll be running around punching up my man them and that. And like, where's Jelani? No, he's been excluding it. Ah, we'll smack him up when he gets back to school tomorrow or whatever. I'm like, what? Man, I'm putting out hits, you know, on man. So anyway, my little brother um, obviously went to my school, innit? So I remember one time I went into his room and I can't remember why I asked him this. I said to him, oh, you see like the year above you, did they used to like, um... I said, oh, did you ever used to get beaten up in school? Not bullied, but like beaten up in school uh, by the year above. And he said, no. I said, oh, okay. What, you, the year above you never used to beat up people in your year? And he said, no, yeah, they used to beat up people in my year group, but they never touched me. So I said, why? Was well, you cool with them? He's like, no, I wasn't cool with them. But they heard I had an older brother. I said, wow! They heard about man's reputation and that. Now, I don't know if it's a street thing or a school thing, but man wasn't no bad boy like that in school. So it must have been a street thing. How the stories come from the street into school, I don't know. But it does happen because I know in school, we knew about people like Mark Lambie and all the olders in Edmonton and Tottenham and Wood Green and that. We used to talk about them in school. So I don't know how... The street reputation migrates itself into school, but yeah, they must have heard about man on road. And don't get it twisted, I want no stab up, stab up man on the road, but I was active back in the day on the street, definitely. So yeah, my little brother never got touched. And again, none of these people who would be like, oh, I'm not going to touch Jay's little brother and that, they don't know what I look like. I was just a name or a story. Um, yeah, man, man, man. I was surprised because my little brother never said nothing to me about that until I asked. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I, I even went to Alwood School. I went there for about seven days, and then my mom. What happened was I didn't get into Alwood. I didn't get into Winchmore straight away. I went to Alwood, and my mom was on the appeals list, and it was almost like when we used to go to appeal the case, it was like going to court. We used to have to go to the civic center in Enfield Town to appeal the case so my, so I could go to Winchmore. It was like being in a courtroom. It was mad. And after being at Howard School for a week, my mum got the letter, ah, oh, I've been accepted into Winchmore. I was like, right, that's it. Took me out. I was off school for a day. Or I was off school for about two days. In between that time, me and my mum ran around Edmonton and wherever to get the school uniform for Winchmore. And bam, next thing you know, man's rocking up in blue shirts. Yeah. Yeah, man. I remember I came into school as well for the first time. I was the new kid on the block because obviously everyone started year seven at the same time and that. And I come with my little cornrows and that. Man, I see a couple of girls looking like, yeah, it's going to be a good experience, man. Yeah, I would never trade up going to that school, though. 